Hi, Stephanie here from Simply On Demand. Welcome back to my channel. So today I want to show you how we can take a PDF document, upload it into Canva, and then edit the document from there. So this is what my PDF looks like. This is day one workbook on the Build Confidence with Canva bootcamp that I host occasionally. Now, as you will see, this is what it looks like. And you will notice when I'm going to upload that some of the, um, the effects are definitely a little bit haywire. All right, so this is what it looks like. So what we simply do is when we're in Canva, we can click on create a design. And at the bottom, it says import PDF. Or what we can do is when we have our file our um, file explorer open in front of us. We simply click on the PDF. As you can see, I've picked it up and we simply drag it across into Canva and drop it. And now it will upload. Depending on, your conne on the connection speed, it may take a while or it can go very quickly. My connection is a little bit slow at times. So I'm going to pause this recording and revisit it the moment it, um, it has uploaded. All right, I'll see you in a bit. All righty, so here we are back and it took about four minutes for a six page uh, document. This is the original, remember, to upload to Canva. So, you know, six, uh, it's not that bad, but just keep in mind the lengthier the document, the more, um, resources it's going to use and the longer it will take to upload. So this is, let me just minus that. I don't want to give feedback right now because at the end of the day, the graphics didn't really turn out that well. Th the text didn't turn out that great. The text is worse, but there's a little bit more error that I want to show you as well. So I just want to make this larger and do that moment over there and get this going over here so we can look at it side by side. Let me just do that so we can look at it side by side. So basically, as you can see, there's a lot that is different. The formatting of the text over here, as we can see it here, it's completely changed. The coloring has changed. There's a, there's a, that with Stephanie over there ends up behind the day one over here. The text effect itself, um, this is the effect that I want, that I used over here was the splice. As you can see, it didn't work, work out so well at all. Um, so that's page one. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. No, this is not too bad at all. Let's have a look on this page over here. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Okay. Um, the picture over there. The screenshot turned out well. And then this over here. Not too bad either. So it's really the, the, the worst part of it is on page one itself. Let's just resize this to get it back to the original size. So the most for the most part, it's page one where a lot of the um, extra work is going to, to have to take place. Now, this is a very simple document. So you need to understand the more complex the document, the more there is going to have to be done about it within it. And that is how we upload a PDF into Canva that we can now go and, and edit. All right, so as you can see, the text box over here, is a little bit wonky. This one shows better. Actually, I like that. But be it as it may, so you can go and 
and play around with it, uh, change the color as you normally would, and see what happened over there now. Oh my goodness. All right, so let me not take up too much of your time, but as you can see, there's a lot that needs to be done still, and I'm sure that uh, Canva will let us know once all of the little gremlins has been sorted out. If you're watching this over on YouTube, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell so that you are notified every time I upload a new video. If there's anything, as always, don't hesitate to ask. I'm happy to have a chat with you. All the best. Take care.